Hey guys, what's up? Welcome back to the drive through Thursday here at Big John TV, where we're all about food, family, family, and fun. That's how we roll. Thanks for tuning in. Thursdays, we like to track down, find new foods. I didn't say that right. And it started off, and it immediately threw me off. On Thursdays, we like to find what's hot and trending in the world of fast food drive throughs quick bites, takeaways, um, if it's making restaurant windows, TV commercials, Facebook ads, app deals. Those are the foods we're going to be tracking down for you. So you know whether you should stop and get it or that's not the right word either. What? If you should try it or keep on driving. Something like that. Here we go. We're going to taste new food from a fast food joint. How about that? Now sometimes in the fast food world you get excited you go get your food and you're like yeah that's great. Sometimes you get excited and you go there and you get ripped off or they misled you or they don't have what they were supposed to and then they don't ask you the right questions and you don't get the right things. This one's a little bit uh, frustrating to me right now. I'm going to be cool. I'm going to be chill. It's all good. Not the end of the world. But the whole premise for this video was the new milkshake they were supposed to have. But they don't have it. And this was the second location. The first location said on the app that they didn't have it. The second location did not say that. So it kind of throws a curveball into the whole game. That being said, they do have new, re returning new popcorn chicken. So we are going to get a video out of some popcorn chicken. It is back. It's been out before, and we've done a video on it before, which is why we weren't here for this. We are here for the milkshake. But, but it is what it is. So let's talk about the popcorn chicken. You can have a regular popcorn chicken or spicy popcorn chicken, or you get the 50-50 popcorn chicken combo box. So you get half and half regular and spicy. Here you go. And you get a side of fries and a soda for a total of, are you ready for this? Set, $8.49. A little bit pricey for a box of nuggets. And no napkins, no sauce. And that's it. So that's where we are. We've got a box of nuggets. They look decent. You can tell the spicy ones got a little bit of a red color, a little orangish tinge to it. It's spicy. It's soggy. Eh. Pretty bad texture. They're not even all that good. <clears throat> they are hot. Scale of one to ten, I'm gonna give this maybe a one and a half or two. You wanna try a spicy one then? No. Here's a regular one. Nice crunch. There's just something off with the texture of these. Are they plant based? I, you know, they're not fried right. They may have been sitting around a little while. I mean, it's a decent pile. They're pretty looking. They have a nice crunch. But they're just, the texture inside is just weird for me right now. I'm not sure why. Like, I'm trying to be clean and, and, and honest and fair and not hold it against them of all the strikes I've already shared. I love Jack in the Box. Did I even, did I even say that's where we were? We're Jack in the Box. One of my favorite fast food joints. But these are really disappointing, and I'm kind of bummed. The texture is just not that good. These taste like they were microwaved. Yeah. Yeah. I'm sure Jamie will like them. 
You tried the regular one? No, tr no trying the spicy? No, I don't want the spicy right now. Um, so I'm going to put those back. Hopefully Jamie will eat them. Now they're falling out of the box. Let me clean my hands. <laughs> Would you like a french fry? Oh, sure. That's a good fry. They have really good fries to so check in the box. Although I will say, that one was cold at the bottom. There's something not right with their fryer. They're not frying at the right temperature, or they're not sitting long enough. So, there's their french fries. There's their uh, popcorn chicken. That was kind of a bummer. Uh, well, we can share with you the uh, Diet Dr. Pepper. Uh, not diet, that's regular. I don't remember what I ordered. So that's probably my bad on that one. And because they didn't have the Pineapple Express milkshake, we got a Oreo cookie milkshake. I'd already paid for it, so I certainly wasn't going to drive away with nothing. There's the cherry on top. That is super thick. Holy cow. Well. I think you might have to wait a little bit longer on that. All right. Yep, it's an Oreo cookie milkshake. I was really hoping for the pineapple one. That would have been good. That was um, not bad, though. It's not bad. It's, it's just a regular, pretty basic uh, Oreo cookie milkshake. It's solid. Good ice cream flavor. Good thick ice cream. I can dig that. It definitely needs to melt a little bit before we can actually get into it and drink it. Um, so kind of making a video out of nothing here. The popcorn chicken was just completely mediocre. I would not come back for that. Um, they, they can go ahead and take that one away. I don't know if it's just this location or what. We don't usually come to this one, but I am pretty not thumbs up with this review. The popcorn chicken, mediocre. No pineapple express milkshake. Maybe just will pop a picture of it and be like, that's what it should have been like because that's why we're here is for that one, but it is what it is. Bummer. I don't like doing bum, bum reviews. I, I really don't. I really like finding the positives and things and not harping on employees and restaurants, but I, this is just a negative all around. Yeah. Sorry, Jack. No dice. And we're done. So, we're on all the social medias. You should come follow us on all of them. Uh, Facebook, Instagram, Twitter, and TikTok. Mostly TikTok and Facebook Reels. I like those. And then Instagram as well. You can do Jamie's line. Um, like, subscribe, share, friends. That's right. Uh, if you haven't done that, you really, really should. If you dig our content, please share. Please subscribe. Ring the notification bell. Leave a comment down below. Um, what sounds better to you? Pineapple milkshake or Oreo cookie milkshake? Honestly, I'd take either. I would take either as well, but pineapple is new and limited. And apparently it's so limited that it's already gone. All right, we're out. Thanks for watching. See you.